happy birthday, Malcolm. And if you have a story you'd like to share with us, you can email us or contact us via social media. Now we are heading back to Ragley Hall, where Shafali has that all-important bank holiday weather. Thanks, Lizzie. I bet you thought I couldn't wear dungarees, but uh, hey, they're so comfortable, and that's what you need at this sort of festival. But we did have a few spots of rain earlier on, but we've been extremely lucky because there have been a few thundery showers around today, quite heavy ones, but we have narrowly missed them. However, we could be caught out by the time we get to tonight or maybe tomorrow because they're going to be rumbling on into the first part of tonight and then they're going to clear. But take a look at our Weather Watchers pictures. We had lovely sunshine to start with today. We've kept a lot of the sunshine in places where the showers haven't occurred, but by the afternoon, many places did cloud over. But this is how the bank holiday weekend is looking in summary. Saturday, we've got some showers. The sharpest of them will be during the afternoon. And that looks like being the wettest day of all. Sunday, bank holiday Monday, we can't rule out the odd shower, but it's mostly dry for both of those days. So the second half of the weekend is looking fairly decent, but it is going to be cooler than it is now. But uh, look at the pressure chart. We've got those showers rolling in from the west. That's tomorrow. And then after that, there is going to be another frontal system that's pushing in by the end of Sunday. But that should clear by the time we get to bank holiday Monday. Back to this evening then and overnight. And we've still got some showers to get through. Those are going to be clearing southeastwards, taking the cloud with it. So for a brief time overnight, we're going to see clear skies, during which time our temperatures are down to about 7 to 9 Celsius. So it will be a fresh, cool night. But then you can just see the first sign of those other showers moving in from the northwest towards the end of the night. And this is what we have through the day tomorrow. So if you're in the south of the region, maybe even into central parts, we start off on a sunny note and then those showers start to roll in. And as I say, some of them could be on the lively side, quite sharp into the afternoon, maybe the odd rumble of thunder as well. Top temperatures of around 16 in the north to 18 in the south. So 16 is going to feel quite cool compared to what we've had at the beginning of the week. And then we come to Sunday night and uh, Sunday itself, well, that's going to be fairly wet and that's because we've got the system rolling in from the west. But Sunday itself, there could just be the odd shower. Sunday night, the rain comes through and we've got some ridging into Monday, oh which means that that's going to be mainly dry with just the occasional shower. But as I say, generally speaking, the second half of the weekend is looking A-OK. -okay. Enjoy. Thank you. And that was the Midlands Today. We'll be back at 10.30. Have a great evening. Bye-bye.